Hello, future Redbirds. I'm Lavester Johnson, Vice President for Student Affairs at Illinois State. But when you see me on campus, feel free to call me LJ. Now, while we're not able to be together physically on campus, it's still important for you to understand what it means to be a part of the Redbird community. And that's what I want to talk to you about today. Now, Illinois State University is a very special place. Strong relationships and connections are formed because we're a caring community with a lot of pride. We celebrate our accomplishments as well as our traditions, right? Like wearing red, right, to show our pride as being Redbirds. We treat members of our campus community like family. We respect each other, we support one another, and we show care for all Redbirds. That's what connects us as a Redbird community. We strive to make all of our Redbirds feel valued and included at Illinois State. That's why we offer hundreds of involvement opportunities that meet our students' interests and needs at our institution. In fact, I am talking to you from our brand new Student Involvement Center that supports over 400 student organizations on campus and coordinates special events. There is actually so much happening on campus, either through our virtual programs or our small in-person experiences. And we can't wait until we can once again host our full schedule of campus programs and activities. Now involvement is a crucial piece of your campus experience. Getting involved helps you make connections across campus as well as helps you pursue your passions and your interests. It also supplements what you learn inside the classroom. It provides those hands-on learning opportunities that you can apply throughout your career. I could go on about the benefits of campus involvement, but who better to hear from than our students? Okay Redbirds, let's do this. Hunter. I am a senior mass media major here at ISU and I'm from Sycamore, Illinois. The Redbird community is a tricky thing to describe because uh, it's a unique experience to uh, each individual. But I think that's also part of what makes the Redbird community great is that everybody is unique um, and everyone has that opportunity to interact with a range of individuals, um, learn to work with them, learn from them. Hello, my name is Teresa. I'm a Community Health Promotion Senior, and I'm from Muhammad, Illinois. I would describe the Redbird community as something that help, is here to help you succeed and is a group that, you know, is here to help coordinate for your future, essentially. Hi, my name is Ashley. I am a junior nursing and Spanish double major from Lamont, Illinois. I think no matter what your interests, hobbies, likes, dislikes are, I think that you can find uh, something you love here, you can find a home here. I think there are so many opportunities, so many cool and unique things about our campus that appeal to just every student, every person. I think everybody's got a place here. I think right from the get-go, I knew that this was gonna be a new experience and I would get the most out of it if I just went looking for new experiences and if I opened my door when I was in my room studying on my floor and I could meet my peers and my floor mates or going to the events that they had in the residence halls or on campus, just really diving in and pushing myself to go beyond what was comfortable and that opened up so many new experiences to me and really helped me find new things that I loved about campus. The biggest way that I found my place in the campus community is by getting a little bit outside of my comfort zone and participating in things that I might not have usually participated in. Uh, one of my favorite events on campus that happens every year is Festival ISU. And what's great about Festival ISU is that all the organizations on campus, even organizations from the community, come to the quad um, and I've always thought that it's super neat uh, to see students walking around 
They're able to ask questions, uh, find different ways to get involved uh, on campus and in the community while picking up some free t-shirts and other swag items. A favorite of a lot of students here is Positively Stress-Free that the library puts on. Basically, they have therapy dogs that will come and you can play with them. Um, it's a great stress reliever, especially if you miss your own dog. So one organization that I'm uh, involved with on campus is TV10 through the School of Communication. Uh, to get involved in TV10, uh, you have to take certain classes. It's very much a real world experience and everyone brings something a little different. Everyone's good at something different. I got involved with my organizations through my classmates. I had a very good friend of mine say that she was in um, SWAT and I asked her what that was and then I came to a meeting and you know I loved it so much that now I'm a big part of it. It really helped me meet a lot of people and it really gave me a lot of ways to participate in things that I'm really passionate about. I think being involved opened up so many doors to me so I always recommend that people join RSOs, join clubs, get involved right away because that will open up a lot of new experiences for them. I always thought study abroad was something cool. I wanted to travel the world, but I never thought it was possible just because nursing has such a fixed schedule. Well, study abroad for me, it was, it was like an adventure for me. There are a number of study abroad programs offered through ISU um, and they're all very different. So when I decided to study abroad in Salzburg, Austria, I was looking for classes uh, within communication and Salzburg College offered those, which translated back to ISU well and as part of my academic plan. Finding one that fits for you because there are so many was not a problem at all. Considering the fact that I thought it was impossible to begin with, it was so much easier than impossible. And the advisors really helped me make it work. They were pulling for me the whole time. And I say that if I can do it as a nursing major, anybody can do it. Well, I've had two on-campus jobs, one as a tour guide and one as an office assistant for the Office of International Admissions. And when I fell in love with campus, I just wanted to share that with other students. I wanted them to have a good experience here and find something that they love just like I did. My first job on campus was with the Division of Student Affairs as a multimedia specialist. And I found that job through Illinois State's job website. I was searching the summer before my freshman year. I had applied and interviewed um, and I was hired before I was even on campus, which was a great opportunity for me. I actually found my job at um, Health Promotion and Wellness through my RSO and it was very easy because it was one of those things where they just kind of announced it like, hey, we're hiring. If you're interested in looking for a job position, like come and talk to us or come and apply. Um, so yeah, it was very easy. If a student is looking for a job, there are plenty of opportunities on campus. There is always a department or an office looking for extra help. Sometimes it is difficult, you know, to juggle both working and school assignments. I think that's the biggest way to do it is to, you know, stay focused, stay on task. So having a planner, having a to-do list. Being a full-time student is a lot on its own. So when you add work and other organizations on top of that, certainly it's beneficial, but you have to teach yourself. You have to learn how to manage it all. For me, when I decided to turn down full tuition scholarships to pay to come to ISU, I knew that I had to make the most of my time, and that's why I got so involved. So I just made sure that every bit of my time was used very intentionally. I think my best, most simple piece of advice would be to get involved. I would say definitely do it. Go out, find an organization, even if it's outside of your comfort zone, or you know you don't know if that's going to be the right thing for you to participate in. You never know, you might fall in love with it. I never thought that I would love my RSO as much as I did, but like here I am now the president of it. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Can I say it again? <laughs> Get involved. There are so many opportunities on the campus of Illinois State University and out in the community to be involved in something other than schoolwork. And the benefits to that, you know, aside from having some fun potentially, uh, are the opportunities to meet new people, to learn to work with new people. I think that you get out what you put into it. So if you decide that you just want to be in your room and you don't want to get involved or put yourself out there, 
then I don't think you'll have as good of an experience as somebody who is attending events and getting involved in clubs and joining organizations. I think that getting involved will really make your experience here life-changing and unforgettable. So I hope all of this is giving you a glimpse into what it means to be a Redbird and what campus life looks like at Illinois State. You can also visit our Redbird Life Involvement Portal at redbirdlife.illinoisstate.edu for more information on our student organizations and campus events. I can't wait to meet you in person someday and show you our beautiful campus. On behalf of all of us within Student Affairs, welcome to the Redbird family. Can't wait to see you soon and go birds!